Hello and welcome to Metro Scan, a show that takes you across to Chennai, Kolkata and Mumbai for the latest news from the three metros. And finally, from the commercial capital, we have Divya Suri getting us an update of the day's main stories from Mumbai. Hi, good evening and Merry Christmas to all our viewers. Now the news in detail. Well, moving on to some other stories. Now, artists in Mumbai are all out holding exhibition dedicating their works to the victims of the 2611 tragedy and also selling their paintings all for a noble cause. Senior journalist Prakash B. Joshi's solo exhibition of his recent works entitled Subtle Change was the first one to be dedicated to the victims of the terror attacks. Despite lack of publicity for the event, barring word by mouth and SMSs, the artist managed to attract many viewers, mainly foreigners. The Mumbai terror attack seemed to have shaken the city's artists and painters from their blissful lives with many deciding to dedicate their works to the victims of the 26-11 tragedy. Senior journalist Prakash B. Joshi's solo exhibition of his recent works entitled Subtle Change was the first one to be dedicated to the victims of the mayhem in Mumbai. The five-day exhibition was open to arts lovers from the 22nd of December at Kitab Mahal, Fort area barely a stone's throw away from the terror hit Chhatrapati Shivaji Terminus. Joshi, who perceives painting as a hobby, was deeply moved by the tragedy especially at the Taj Mahal Palace and Tower Hotel. In the past couple of years, he has built up a collection of 38 paintings. Joshi says that his paintings are based mainly on the mysterious and mythical river Saraswati, which has fascinated him since childhood. Joshi, who paints for passion and does not sell his paintings, said that since money collected by the selling these paintings will go for a noble cause, he decided to sell his paintings. Despite lack of publicity for the event, Barring word by mouth and SMSs, the artist managed to attract many viewers, mainly foreigners. Bureau reports, DT News, Mumbai. Well, that's all we carry from Mumbai for today, but we'll be back tomorrow evening with more updates from the commercial capital. Thanks for watching and have a nice evening. Good night. And that was uh, Divya Suri from Mumbai. And that's all in Metro Scan for today. Don't forget to join us every Monday to Friday at 6.30 p.m. And stay tuned for more on DD News. Namaskar.